A new store for people who enjoy work and play in the outdoors has just opened in Burlington. This week, Duluth Trading Company opened their doors to the public at the Vinebrook Plaza at the corner of Mall Road and Middlesex Turnpike. The Duluth Trading Company is one of the newest retailers to be introduced to the East Coast, and the very first store in Massachusetts is right here in Burlington. Well, we started in 1989 with the Bucket Boss uh, and expanded our assortment to clothing and workwear and outerwear uh, that provides uh, function and form for people in the trades and also in, uh, in active hobbies. Um, we uh, have clothing that suits anybody's needs uh, from casual to workwear. And um, we started opening up retail stores in 2006 and we are officially the 18th store in the company. Within this new facility is a variety of clothing and accessories for indoors and out. Um, everything from flannel to underwear to coats, jackets. We also sell tools and knives. Um, we have a lot of things for both men and women. Uh, this holiday season we started carrying some kids clothing, which is going to be a holiday uh, only type of thing. Um, we also have uh, seat covers and things for your automobile, uh, a ton of different things in the store that uh, both provide function, form, and fit, so uh, a lot of things that look great, very fashion forward, uh, the flannels especially, so. Burlington Area Chamber of Commerce President Rick Parker was at the grand opening and said he thought it was a great fit for Burlington. Well, if you've seen the store, it's, it's absolutely incredible. Um, the, the folks at Duluth have a very good um, track record of, of getting very active in the community. They, they treat their employees well, they have a lot of fun, um, but the product is no joke. Um, along the lines of most of the companies that are, that are in the Greater Burlington area, the products are high tech uh, and they're developed um, for a specific purpose and it's, it's world class clothing. One of the biggest parts of the grand opening was the Lumberjack Show, which featured a demonstration of the steel timber sports competitions where professional men and women compete in a series of lumberjack-related challenges. Uh, so today we demonstrated the steel timber sports series events. We did the springboard chop, which simulates um, how, you know, loggers of old used to get above the big root swell on large trees to the easier to cut wood. Um, so we did the springboard chop, standing block chop simulates felling a tree, and underhand chop simulates bucking that in half before the invention of a handsaw. And then we did the single buck saw, which, which is, you know, a modified, it's a racing saw now, but it uses the same technique that was used in the woods before the invention of a chainsaw. Um, and then Mike demonstrated the hot saw, which, you know, the hot saw is, is like, uh, is, is the NASCAR, the, the, uh, the funny car of our sport. And it's basically a snowmobile motor with a sprocket on it, and it cuts uh, 10 times as fast as a traditional chainsaw. Duluth Trading Company would like to say thanks to the town of Burlington for making their grand opening possible. I just want to thank Burlington for having us. Uh, it's already been a lot of fun and uh, we're only into week one, so um, I'm looking forward to, uh, to working with them, uh, the customers and both, uh, both customers and my associates who are also from the area. So it's a, it's a ton of fun and uh, hope to see them, see them all soon. From the Duluth Trading Company, I'm Robert Paris for B News Weekly.